Hi, welcome to another episode of Cashing In on Creativity, the television show. That's right, it was formerly a podcast, now it's a television show. I'm your host, Bruce Outridge, and we look uh, at different on creative entrepreneurs, whether they be artists, authors, musicians. Today, <laughs> I hope you're ready to laugh, because today we're going to talk to my friend Mark Crocker. Now, Mark is a ventriloquist, uh, and so this is going to be a bit different. There may be more than one of us on, on the show. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, this was a very funny show. Uh, I first met Mark at uh, a corporate event. So uh, in the trucking industry, which uh, many of you may or may not know, I've been a, I drove for 25 years. I'm very in, involved in that industry. And Mark, uh, was, I was at an event for the industry um, put on by a company involved in the industry. And Mark was the entertainment. Mark was wandering around with uh, his puppet, if you can call it that. Although they seem almost human to me um, and and just talking to people and making people laugh and that's what he does but he is very accomplished he's been on some of the biggest stages in the world and it was so interesting uh, to get to know him a little bit there and afterwards I thought man this has got to be a great interview for the podcast and so we reconnected and since then we've been following each other he lives just uh, in the Barry area or just north of Barry and um, uh, is is always uh, looking for corporate events so if you're looking for somebody to be extremely funny and uh, uh, I would certainly highly rec um, recommend Mark to be part of that event but we're going to find out about how he got started as a ventriloquist and I got to tell you this is one you will not want to miss. I have the incredibly talented Mark Crocker and is it Elmer? Who's, who's our partner? Uh, th th this is Chester. Chester. So I have Chester, Chester and yeah. Mark aka yes. Mark. <laughs> okay. So how are you guys doing? How are we doing? Having a conversation today, or it is a it's it's a great Monday, and it's certainly nice to see the sun out. We're still snow covered, but I think in another couple of weeks, we still got two feet of ice on the lake. We still got some ice, so it's not like down south there. But uh, all's good in the world, right? I almost feel like I should have just sent you questions and just like stayed off the channel. I got a feeling you probably do a better interview between the two of you. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 just to, to bring our listeners in, and I'm going to just let our listeners know that um, if you are not viewing this, if you're listening to this on the podcast, uh, urge you to go to the video channel, YouTube, our YouTube channel, uh, or Mark's YouTube channel, and uh, check this out because it's certainly a very unique interview uh, to have you two on. So. Mark, you and I met at a recent event um, for a, co a company called Transcore that we both work with and uh, uh, was very impressed with you and uh, what you're doing. And so I thought we'd have this chat. So tell us uh, well, it, tell us uh, how you got started in this, I guess, is the best way. How did, how you become an illusionist? <laughs> how do, well, we, we say, you say, you say, I say vocal illusionist because... They make much more money than a ventriloquist. <laughs> it's you no know, because people always sort of went, ooh, ventriloquist, and they they're thinking, hi there, boys and girls, how are you today? And we didn't want that because we're we go after corporate work. We don't do the um, you know the kids shows. Right. And uh, so we started saying vocal illusionist, and you know buyers going, ooh, oh, vocal illusionist. Yeah. All right. I don't know if you're still laughing. <laughs> that was so hilarious. Uh, anyway, you can find Mark at markcrocker.com. And uh, he is such an amazing artist. Uh, to do that and to do it with the, the style and technique that he does is, is just amazing. So uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Thank you again for watching the Cashing In on Creativity television show. And uh I look forward to seeing you again in the future. Bye for now.